Hello everyone and welcome back to uh, episode 8 of the uh, Randomizer Nuzlocke Platinum uh, Moemon. Uh, yeah, just just unscramble that. So we're in the cave and uh, we're going to be fighting some people. So I can't remember exactly what I did Whoop. Uh, between episodes. It's been a bit slacking. Okay, so that's a normal type. Uh, but I didn't, uh, but it doesn't really matter if I didn't, uh, went and go got Pokeballs, because, you know, I already, uh, killed the Pidgeot that was here. So, uh, I'm hoping that, uh, I can either get through this quickly, so I can go to the gym, or I can at least get to the gym this episode. I might not be able to fight through it yet. Uh, gonna throw in a Chansey. Uh, yeah, I'll throw in Homura. Get some, ho hopefully get a level. Ah, oh, man. It, it was a good break that I got an Entei. <laughs> that... That's the weirdest one. I'm guessing it's supposed to be like they're wearing like a onesie that gives that like appearance. But oh shit, missed. Okay. What does that do? Defense harshly fell. Okay. How much does that do? Okay, that does like nothing. Oh yeah, and I gave it the shell bell. Ah. Oh. That's prevented from here. Okay. Okay, I'm not gonna be able to do much with uh, home run out, but at least the XP got uh, let me split. Uh, I'm gonna send out Neptune. Uh, so I'm not sure what the level cap prior to a. Uh, I think that's a ground type, so I'm not too worried. Uh, I'm not sure what the level cap before like the gym is in that uh, like Pokemon listening. I just assume that it's probably 15 to 20. God, this this Chansey has just defense. Of course, I'm not I can't really use stab moves, so that doesn't help. Uh, and stab is same type attack bonus. That's it. So, if you use a type of move that has the same element as the Pokemon using it, they'll get, I think it's like a 1.25 or like a 1.5 uh, bonus ratio on it. So, yeah, this cave isn't very long, and I could skip these trainers, but I'd rather uh, take them. And I didn't even go up in the cave earlier, but I don't really care. Yeah, Perugly. Only really shows up in this gen, as I said prior. Uh, it's not an extremely, uh... Let me use Dragon Dance. Ooh, that's not good. Okay, it was weak. Because I believe Grass Knot gets stronger the, uh... The, um... The heavier the Pokémon. So, uh, Cedra isn't that heavy. But if I used it against a, uh... A, like, slacking, or a, um, I'm just gonna be safe with this one. Uh, I'm gonna send out Cooper. I don't wanna risk it. Because if I miss and she hits with it, I'm dead. But Grass Knot wouldn't do anything to Cooper, because, uh, Magic Coat, that is... I think that's special moves that it just takes less damage from, or just damage. I'm not sure. Level. Okay. See, the crappy thing is, I'd be like, if this wasn't randomized, I'd be like, great, this next gym Cooper, just all the way. Or Cedra, all the way. But, I don't think the typings will stay the same. <laughs> okay, so I'm in Orberg City. So this is where the uh, next gym is. Or the gym is. <laughs> First gym. I don't have one. I'll take you to the Pokemon gym. See, I, I like these escort things just for the sake of them being there, but 
is kind of annoying because I could figure it out myself. Um, I'm going to go to the Pokemon Center first. Okay. And uh, I did realize that um, in the uh, beginning town, there is a small lake pond or lake at the bottom. I believe it's part of a route. But I would, if push comes to shove, I would be able to go back there with like an old rod and uh, be able to catch a Pokemon because I haven't technically gotten a Pokemon in town or on that route. So uh, I do have a couple backup plans for uh, Puff Oh, it's you, Puffle, brah. Finally got here. You're slow like always, brah. And the gym leader's tough. Like, seriously, serious. Uh, gym leader's this tough. I wonder how he compares to my dad, brah. Huh? I just drifted there. And my bra leader's gone off to the coal mine, bra. You want to take on gym leader? You better go off to mine. Okay. So I'm going to try and find the Pokemon first. Uh, I think this is uh, coal mining in you. Uh, this is basically a town where they introduce fossils, I believe. So I will be able to get a fossil Pokemon. Uh, I mean, yeah, I don't have any. So I'm going to take three. Leave me with that. And I buy that. Okay, so now I desperately need trainers to come. <laughs> um, okay. And then the coal mine is down over here. So uh, the coal mine is essentially this game's uh, version of like the uh, of like ruby and sapphires uh, like hidden bases because I believe you could make a hidden base in the mines uh, if I'm correct okay Orberg mine I believe Pokemon can show up here oh yeah I just forget. thought this was super weird okay I found a dome fossil um, <laughs> that I just appears to be part of a shell so I'll be able to get a fossil. I was not expecting to just pick up a fossil. Okay. Okay, cool. So, Pokemon from Warburg Mines. A Quagsire. Okay, this is, I believe, groundwater. Um, I'm going to switch in Homura. And... Uh, just try and uh, uh, chip it down a bit more. Cross chop. That's not the best. Okay. Luckily, that's a fighting type move. Uh, although, I believe it has a high crit chance. Which I'm not too happy. Wow, goddamn. Ooh, Aqua Tail. That's not good. That was super effective. I'm not sure. I think I can take one more of those, but I'm gonna lead seed. Aqua tail. I might have to switch out of. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna switch out. I'm gonna. I just wanted to get at least one of the uh, dot moves in. But yeah, that was a bit dangerous for what I'm catching. Um, go to Pokemon. Um, cross Chop and Aqua Tail, I would feel safer with Cooper out, um, but I could also put Londa out, uh, yeah. because Body Slam, that's a bit annoying, okay, so has at least three moves. Luckily, this is going to uh, get me my some of my health back. Uh, I'm going to use smoke screen. Hopefully, it'll just stop hitting. Damn. Okay. That's not bad. So I basically just want Leech Seed to be able to damage it and get me my health back. That I lose by hail, and hopefully, through repeated smoke screens, uh, this Quagsire won't be able to uh, hit me. Because smoke screen is a good way to. 
just ensure that I don't really take all that much damage. Let's cross chop. Okay. But I'm a fighting type, so that shouldn't do that much. That was a critical hit, like I thought. And I think Hail only does like max three damage. Did two damage. Okay. Yeah, cross chop has a high critical hit chance. Um, I'm going to send out Cooper. Because cross chop, body slam, aqua tail. I'm not sure if grass resists water, but I have a feeling it just won't be using Aqua Tail. Uh, okay, good. It's starting to miss now on uh, on that. Okay. And then I get my health back, and this should bring it down pretty. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna try a Pokeball because unfortunately I don't have any moves that give it like a status ailment. Like, nothing to give it paralysis. Yes! Good job. Awesome. Uh, it has an easygoing nature. It doesn't care if it bumps its head on boats and boulders while swimming. Yes. Uh, yeah, I'll give, a I'll give a nickname to my Quagsire. Um, uh, I'm going to name you... Derpy Dur. Yep, Miss Derpy Dur. Okay, I'm going to go heal my Pokemon. Uh, just make sure that they're all at like a uh, able body health. Because a couple of my Pokemon are pretty low. Luckily, they put the uh, Pokemon Center right uh, in front of the uh, mines. So, we are already a little bit more successful. I was glad I bought those Pokeballs, because it would have sucked to have forgotten, or at least assumed I had pre purchased them previously. Sorry, I had trouble getting that word out for some reason. Uh, I just saw an item up here. Oh, found a Hyper Potion. When I wasn't even looking at it, I found, the, found a Red Flute. That's a battle item. On the sky plate. Okay. When the universe was created, it's played. Okay, cool. So that's like an RCS item. Um, what does the red flute do? Um, red flute snaps a single. Oh, damn, that's awesome. So if a Pokemon uses attract, I can uh, snap a Pokemon out of it, which is really nice because that's one of the few uh, stas ailments that. I believe you just don't get like an item for. I think maybe like a full restore would do it. But other than that, like, I think you're just kind of shit out of luck. A Tyranitar. Okay. I believe this is Ground Dragon, but it's also super heavy, so Grass Knot should kill it. I would like to get a Tyranitar, but I, I believe that I probably wouldn't have been able to catch it. In that, it probably has a very extremely low catch rate. Like, up there with. Legendary catch rates. Um, of course, I was able to catch an Entei, but that's beside the point. It's neither here nor there. Okay, cool. So, this is a trainer. I, I expected them to be trainers, but I wasn't quite sure. Blastoise? Okay, Grass Knot. Because <laughs> you're a heavy water type. Uh, Grass Knot. Bam. Okay. And. Ooh, you're not dead. That's surprising. Grass Whistle. Okay, so you're gonna put me to sleep. Damn. Okay. Uh, I'm going to just switch out for Cooper. Boomerang? That's a normal move. Oh, okay. It's one of the multi-hit normal moves. Okay. And then... I'll just use Dragon Claw, because Dragon's good against, like, everything. Or at least does neutral damage against everything. Okay. Worker Mason. Cool. So I've got some money. Um, I could use an Awakening on him, but I'd rather not, 
use a uh, use an item yet. I, I want to kind of conserve those for um, for like important battles. Ooh, a shop it. Uh, okay, so flame wheel. Ooh, psychic, that's not good. Okay, fuck. Um I'm just gonna run. <laughs> Don't wanna risk it. Okay. So we're at uh, over 15 minutes at this point. So I'm gonna end this episode here. So we did catch a quagsire, which was nice. Um and in this next episode, I will uh, make sure I find the gym leader so that way we can go fight the gym. So I hope you all have a very nice day and will join me in the next episode. Bye. Thank you